Hi, I'm Leo with Primeline Products, and in this video I'm going to show you how to change the slide bolts on your storm window in just a few easy steps. Inside this frame there are some die cast corner keys which are holding the frame together. We'll need to drill out these indentations from both sides using a 3 seconds drill bit. The only thing you want to be cautious is not to drill all the way through. We just want to break through the, the surface on, on both sides one at a time. Now that we've drilled out the indentations, I'm going to flip this over and do the same on the opposite side. So this side only has two indentations. This leg does not have any, so I just got to drill those out and we'll be ready to separate this. Okay, so I've got this frame drilled out uh, just through the surface on both sides, on both ends. I've got it clamped down to my workbench, so now I'm going to use my wood block and my hammer to tap it out gently. I'm just going to work it on both ends. What you're seeing on the ends is the corner keys that are in there. But this now gives us access to the, uh, the slide bolts. So to release my slide bolt, I have to pop out this corner key, which we've already pre-drilled. So I've got it clamped down on the opposite end to my workbench. I'm going to use a flat screwdriver and just lightly tap it out. And there it is. Okay, so once you've purchased all your replacement parts, we're ready to put it back together. We're going to go in the reverse order, making sure our spring is in there first, uh, then our slide bolt. And then the corner key. And I have this clamped on the opposite end if you needed to tap that in, and you just a few gentle taps with the hammer. And then we're going to use, a, you can use a nail set. And these same holes, we're just going to tap them in again. To lock that corner key in place. And I'm going to do the same on the opposite side. Okay, so our next step is to reassemble the top rail back to this frame. Uh, to make it easier for me, I'm going to stand it up, and that way I can hammer down on it. Make sure you have your safety glasses on, and your slide bolts you want to have facing you, opposite side of the weather stripping, and I'm lining up the corner keys in the outer channel of this frame. And with a rubber mallet, just tap it in gently. Just working it down on both sides evenly. And there it is. So from here I'm going to lay it back down and pound in these, uh, these indentions again with the nail set. Okay, so final step. We've got the top rail indentations punched in already. We just need to do the ones on the vertical legs. Well, that completes this project. Thank you for watching.